16 across. It's green and often found on football pitches. Five letters, G-R-A something something. <laughs> green, often found on football pitches. G-R-A something something. <laughs> Grandstand? No, it's not. <laughs> That's too long, Grandstand, no. G-R-A something something. Grass. What? Grass. A child of five could see it's grass. Excuse me, I mean, who's doing this cross with me, you? Well, will you try not to talk so loud, please? We're all trying to do proper crosswords here. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, sorry. Proper crosswords? What do you mean by that? Proper crosswords? I'm trying to do the Mephistopheles in the Financial Times, a crossword which you wouldn't know where to start. As it happens, I could do any crossword put in front of me, including Mephistopheles. <laughs> <laughs> Just happens that I prefer the Sun, Junior Coffee Time, Easy Clues, that's all. <laughs> Just a matter of taste, that's all. <laughs> the Sun. People only buy that for one thing. Rather, a couple of things. <laughs> Two across. There you are. See what I mean? <laughs> they peck holes in your milk bottle tops. <laughs> Four letters. <laughs> something, something, T.S. <laughs> That's a typical sun clue, that is. <laughs> Peck holes in your milk bottle top, sunny, sunny, tears. Bats. <laughs> bats. Bats. Since when did you last see a bat peck a hole in your milk bottle top? Well, it might do if it was hungry. You're the one that's bats. If you want the correct answer to that clue, I suggest you look at page three. <laughs> now, please try to desist as I am attempting to concentrate. It's red, it smells, <laughs> and it's often picked in the garden. Four letters, something, O-S-E. <laughs> That's not right. Pardon? It's rose, rose, it's obvious. It's red, it smells, and it's often picked in the garden. Rose. Well, it could be nose. <laughs> anything like that crossword. <laughs> I really never seen anything like I mean you've got it all absolutely wrong. I mean look, look what you've got here, look. Place where fish are kept, you've got coop. <laughs> I mean could you when did you last hear of fish being kept in a coop? Co-op, yes, fish. <laughs> This one here. You've got uh, a strange animal found in a hive. You've got queer bee. <laughs> well, but well, it's queen. Well, it's the same thing. Oh, no, it's not. <laughs> Certainly not down my road, it's not. <laughs> queen, it has to be queen because of the N on the end fits in with the clue that goes down, you see. Look, he always plays with big ears. Roddy. <laughs> It's Noddy, you fool. Roddy in Toyland. No, it's not Roddy in Toyland, it's Noddy. Roddy in Toyland, big ears, and PC Plop. <laughs> PC Plod, Plod, don't you know anything? PC Plod with his, Noddy. His name is Roddy. Of course it's not, his name is Noddy. Roddy. He was called Noddy because he had a bell on his hat and every time he nodded it rang. He used to go, hello, I'm little Noddy. Hi, little <laughs> Noddy, not, not Noddy. <laughs> I'm, all right, all right, I'm sorry. I do apologise, it's this man who's driving me mad. <laughs> I've only got one clue left. Oh, good. Terrific. Now, look, ladies and gentlemen, if we, if we just help him with this last clue, do you think he'll shut up? We'll ask him. If we help you with this clue, will you shut up? I promise. Oh, good. He's promised. Go on, then. What's your last clue? Go on. Six across, four letters, often found in the bottom of a birdcage. <laughs> <laughs> something, something, IT. <laughs> Grit. <laughs> Excellent. 
great, of course. <laughs> Has anybody got a rubber? <laughs> <laughs>